Hi guys, Creative Lori here. Welcome everyone. Okay, so this is part two of my monthly um, grocery haul that's supposed to be for $50 a month. And um, I found a lot of specials, so I did go overboard a little bit. But in my defense, I feel like I should be able to carry over the money I didn't spend last month for this month if I want to. I think last month I spent $22.19. Um, I'll write it in the description box, but um, I used up everything. <laughs> Absolutely everything to the last piece of cilantro. You name it, I used it. But that's the way we should eat. We shouldn't be throwing things away. So anyway, I spent um, $35 something um, for this haul. And I only had fourteen fifty left to, you know, uh, as a balance to use. So I think I went over by 17, I don't know what it was, 27 or something. And I'll write that all in the description box. But, you know, I don't think it's too bad, considering a lot of these things will last a little while or they're for a special occasion. Let me go and jump in and show you. So some things are from the Dollar Tree. Um, one of them is the Pepper Jack. It's a thin block, but it is five ounces, and I slice it um, thin, like this way, horizontally, really thin. It's like, I don't need that much cheese. So this lasts me quite a while. And my that's going to be for me. My dad will probably take this one, the Monterey Jack cheese. He likes Monterey Jack. Um that's before Pepper Jack was even a thing. My mom used to only buy Monterey Jack. Then I did get some cream cheese because there's something I want to do with that. And I'll just show you maybe. But, um, well, I'll tell you about it when, when I get to that. My dad likes um, white cake. So I know I can get this cheaper at Walmart. But it was a dollar and I was there. I don't like going to Walmart at all. And every time I try to order on the app so I can do a pickup... It, it, there's something happens and I've spent like an hour shopping <laughs> looking for everything so I've kind of given up but I'll, I'll get back to it but it's happened to me like five times so that's why I'm like forget it um, this is the vanilla funfetti now my dad won't care about the candies on top but um, I'll take that off and save them for my nephew's birthday and so my dad just likes white frosting with coconut. And then I'll do my marmalade in between the layers, which he likes. That'll be for Father's Day. Um, and then I thought about doing something fun with the, these. These are like little cr mini crescents, but they are slightly sweet, even though it says plain. They're kind of the Mexican version of the um, little shell plain ones that look like this that have cinnamon in the dough. So I thought about poking a hole in them and then doing like something with the cream cheese and like a jelly or jam in the middle and then drizzling like a little bit of um dark chocolate on top or something different for him and then i'm going to put them in a tin he'll have to like put them in the freezer i mean i'll put them in a ziploc bag so that way he can freeze them and just take one at a time one at a time because <laughs> he is diabetic so just one at a time and they're small enough that would be nice for with your coffee as a treat or dessert so I think I'm going to try that and when I try to attempt it I will show you but I also got this because um mainly because um so if that doesn't work then I'm mainly going to use this for my beet sandwiches. I already made the beets and I needed some cream cheese because that's nice to have on the sandwich. Then I also got some relish. I was out and I like this especially if I have just like a cheese sandwich. Sandwich which would, I don't know, I like relish on my sandwiches with like mayo and mustard. Okay, that these were all from the Dollar Tree. Oh, and then these tortillas. Let me show you. And I know it's a better buy sometimes to buy the bigger package, but I feel like they're not as fresh. So they're $24 for a dollar, and that's good enough for me and my dad. Now remember, 
My dad does get supplemented a little bit with, by my sister. She buys the meats and she'll buy like lunch meats too, but she always buys the wrong lunch meat. She always buys my dad um, turkey and my dad doesn't really care for it. He likes ham. So I have the ham one. This was $1.99. So I got him one of those. And then that was at, the rest of this is all from Grocery Outlet. Um... Okay, let's go on to the bread for sandwiches. So I just got seven grain. This is like one of their good breads. And this was $1.79. And then we both share this bag. And it's a huge bag, 24 ounce. It's $2.99, I think. Yeah, $2.99. It's huge. And we share. I split it. And we share that. We'll probably have that. <laughs> like until July 4th, so it's perfect. Um, I couldn't find celery for the longest time, but I got one stock and that was 79 cents. It looked really nice. Um, it was in um, a bag, like uh, it's, it's a name brand, I can't think of it, but I just took it out to make everything look nice. Going along with sandwich makings, I bought this, which is Mature Cheddar Slices by Vio Life. It's 100% vegan. I bought four packages because they were uh, 47 cents and they're 10 slices. Look at, I just took these out of the freezer and they're already sweating because it's so hot here. Um, so I'm gonna try to go fast. <laughs> so they were 47 cents. Their vegan and vegetarian things at the store is like always super cheap because nobody buys it. And then if you bought one, you got one free. So I bought four. And I froze three, so these are the three that I froze already, and I had one and I tried it. Now, it's not my favorite cheese, but it gives a really nice texture in your sandwich, and it tastes, it says like cheddar, but it tastes like American cheese slash, like a light, light smoked cheddar, uh, Gouda. And the, the type of slices have that consistency. Yeah, so it says um, 6, 14, 21. So that's why I froze them. Um, but I got four of them. And for what, 20, they were 47 cents each. So that's like uh, 23 and a half cents. Yeah, each. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> now we're on to the salad mix. I've got the big package for, this was four ninety nine. dollars Yeah, for 16 ounce. But I use this all the time. My dad and I excuse me, love this stuff. And I'm probably going to have to go back and get some more greens, but, and maybe a package of, um, shrimp and pastrami, but I'm still going to be within my budget from carryover from last month and this month, I promise. And I will show you that. But the pastrami is for my dad's for Father's Day and the shrimp will be for him and I. Moving on to the, um, produce I got one only one bunch of cilantro and it's a nice bunch for 50 cents um, and then I got uh, two big zucchinis actually they're a really nice size uh, for two for a dollar everything is sweating because it's so hot here then I got a bag of these little mini avocados they were 249 that was a really good deal and they are Haas which is my favorite and I'll tell you what I do with these. I do a lot of things with them. I put them on my curry lentils or curried beans or just beans, sandwiches by themselves. <laughs> but I only eat about, if it's this small, maybe half. Because these are small um, at the most. Okay, then this was the deal of the century. I was so excited. These are called Yucatan avocado halves, and they're the Haas kind. They're three pounds. They're already peeled. They're ready to go. And this was $7.99, so this was my big splurge. But for three pounds, look at this. And I'll tell you what I do with this. When it's already done like this, what I'm going to do, this will last me a couple months for my dad and I. Oops, let me turn the light on. What I like to do with it is when I make a salad of like that, those spring mix greens, 
I'd like to put like one of these on top and then fill the hole with um, tuna fish without mayo. Um, you could do chicken salad sandwich or chicken salad or tuna fish with mayo if you wanted. You could do, um, oh, you could do egg salad also. And these were like the regular size, so this was a great deal. And then sometimes I don't feel like eating the whole half um, of the avocado, so I'll just split it and then I just have a quarter of it. But with the tuna fish, I eat the whole tuna and then, um, and sometimes I put hummus too. That's the other thing, I put hummus in there. Over my salad, and then I take like a little bit of like a homemade dressing and I mix it with like maybe some balsamic and olive oil and then, oh, it's so good drizzled all over the salad. And then you just slice your little, you know, avocado dish with your whatever you have in the center. So I'm super excited about this. Um, my dad, I'll probably give him half of these. And so still, I mean, that's gonna last us over a month for sure but that'll be like a nice little you know luxury to have through the summertime when it's hot and you just take a couple out at a time and defrost them in your fridge and then when you're ready to use it you just there you go and I, I put lemon over them too so good what a great buy $7.99 and they had another three pound bag um, for $10.99 just different brands and I just thought nope that works great for me so that is what I got um, I did go over budget by $17 and uh, 27 cents I think it was or 97 I'll go back and look and I'll put it in the description box but I had like a how much of a balance did I have left over uh, Twenty-seven dollars, no, twenty-eight dollars, almost twenty-eight dollars left over. So the, these sliced cheeses is gonna last me all through the summer. I'm pretty sure because I don't eat a whole lot like that. Um, one is going to my dad, and my dad won't eat those. I already know. One will stay with me. One will go with my dad. Um, so we split everything, except I won't eat the ham because I don't eat meat. Um, uh, he won't, we probably won't split the bread because my sister did buy him bread. She makes him like, she buys him a lot of sandwich stuff and then like meats. So thankfully I don't have to do that, but I mean, she, you know, is it accurate? The $50 a month? I would say so. Cause she's, she doesn't buy a whole lot, but she might buy like a rotisserie chicken for like reduced for three three dollars at Walmart like every two weeks or she'll bring over like maybe a couple of the deli slices um and a loaf of bread I mean whatever you know it's like it's appreciated and so it's it's pretty accurate whenever I buy nuts and everything those are my big purchases and like stuff like this I always account it into my budget so I'm still gonna be having to buy some things. The things that I'll have to buy are probably another salad mix or romaine lettuce. I need to get some pastrami for Father's Day. Um, I am gonna do a barbecue and we're gonna put those beautiful carrots I showed you on the grill, but, oh, there's a fly in here. Um, and then I will have the cake, but I'll make a salad and maybe some guacamole, maybe some potato salad. No, not potato salad. No, 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 no. I don't want potato salad. <laughs> well, if he wants it, I, 